Many thanks, Mrs. H. Absolutely stunning. Thank you for joining me. Good morning. How are you doing? Hope you're comfortable. <laughs> We're halfway through that week again. Can you believe it? It goes very quickly. Well, for me it does. I don't know how yours are doing. I've been to the Paul H. Barbers. Not a, what we call a scalping. <laughs> I've done it myself. So, um, right, using a few different products today. Uh, some I've used for a while. Uh, um, the first being the razor. And this is the Fat Tip or Fat Tip. Fat Tip Piccolo. Three piece non adjustable open comb razor. Quite aggressive. Um, very little overhang on the blade. And talking of the blade, we're having that Gillette Ruby. Um, it, it is on the written on there, but I don't think it's very faint. Uh, Gillette Ruby double edged blade, second use, of course, as I used it before in the last shave. This is a, a very heavy razor. If you like chunky, heavy, short handled razors, you'd love it. This and the Grand, the Fatip Grand, is exactly the same head wise, aggression wise. The only difference is the handle. The ground is hollow, it's lighter, but the Fatip is solid. Lined handle. Good grip, I've used it many times. Um, so I fancied using that. This stuff I've used for a long, long time. Uh, you heard of the Volfix Brush Company? Well, this is their Sicilian Lime. Uh, Volfix, uh, the old original um, Sicilian Lime uh, shaving cream, luxury shaving cream from the old, uh, the Volfix Old Original Shave Brush Company here. And it's a, it is a sort of a greeny, uh, very silky, shiny uh, cream. Looks very luxurious, very sort of um, similar to uh, the Tobbs, the tail of Old Bond Street. Um, I'm going to use my false or faux horn ball. And there's a blob of it in there. There's no ridges or anything that's smooth. I have no problem with that, especially with creams, it's, it's quite easy. And I thought I'd give this uh, using Sicilian lime, lime uh, resin. This is a DS Cosmetic 26 millimeter tuxedo uh, knot. It's, it's, it's named a couple of things, this handle. It's like the, the Empire resin handle. It's just a green uh, link in the description if you want to see it. There. But uh, that's the brush of choice, very nice. Oh, just, just wet that up. Um, and I will, uh, no problem so far. It should stand out even more with each shave, this uh, goatee, goatee, Van Dyke, whatever you want to call it. So, um, here we go. So how are you doing in yourself? I hope so. I hope so. I hope you're okay. See straight away. No messing. That's a lovely scent. Yeah, lime. It's really nice. It's one of the stronger scented lime scents I've had. I've got. Um, but it's not sort of too strong when it's in your face. Uh, again, for me, for my children. Look at that straight away. Isn't that nice? So that's easy, that's as good as we need it. And that'll do for a minute. So the good thing with these plastic or false, false horn brushes, uh, bowls, I can't. <laughs> If you drop them, they don't break. Hopefully. Right. Here we go. So, what's the weather where you are? Because our clocks have gone back now. Um, was it a week, two weeks already? Uh, so um, it'll start going darker now in the evenings and 
it won't get light till later in the mornings. So as I say, this is an aggressive razor. I can get rid of that. Clean up. Aggressive razor. Um, has to be careful with it. Doesn't look. May not look aggressive. Um, open comb doesn't necessarily mean aggression. Uh, some people think it is, but a lot of razors are open comb, but they're not aggressive. You, you can get it. Depends. You see. I mean, it looks quite a. Uh, Nice little timid thing, but uh, you mess about with it and it'll tell you who's the boss. So here we go, first pass, Gillette Ruby, second use. Thank you very much. Here it. Nice and gentle. Absolutely stunning blade. Do you know what I did then? I nearly went like that. <laughs> Come on, wake up. Right. <laughs> Let me just trim this. Um... You can hear it almost sing. That will be a whiskers galore. Whiskers galore. Superb. Yeah, I got my. Uh, Wow, W A H L um, uh, trimmer out, and um, I'm gonna dab handle it now. But uh, oh, the slick! Wow, I forgot how good that is. The scent is gorgeous. If you like citrus, like me, lime. It's a it's a, it's a good, very good um, lime scent. I find, but slickness, wow. If I was to rub that up now because I put water on, I could shave with that. I need to trim this sun. Um... Mm -hmm. Not too worried at the minute, but that's good enough. There we go. So uh, it's nice, very slick. And that um, blade is amazing, I love it. As I say before, it reminds me a lot of the, the super thin, you know, the Gillette super thin blade. So what's your shave of the day for a midweek shave if you have one? Or you have on Tuesday or Thursday, whatever. Here we go, cross the growth. Volfix, the old original brush, shave brush company. Sicilian lime, very nice. Oh, that's another thing somebody asked, um, I'm not sure if this is in person actually, but I'll answer it on here as well. Somebody says, do you use both sides of the razor? Absolutely. So when I'm, say like I'm doing this now, like that, 
I'll either turn it as it is, use the other side, or even if I rinse like this, I remember I've just used that size and I turn, you don't see it on camera I suppose, but I do turn, alternate every other. Um, some people rotate the blade, that's where the numbers are on the blade, one, two, three, four, so you go side one, side two, turn it that way, side two, turn it over, side three, turn it round, side four. I don't find the need to do that, personally. Weather-wise, what we had, we've had a bit of wind and rain, lot of rain, lots of rain. <laughs> um, so I imagine the rivers, well, the rivers are full, but the reservoirs are all filling up because they were quite low actually. So that's good. Plenty of water, and then uh, as well as we, I'm not sure if we need any more, but we've had plenty of rain. Here we go. This another well, tuxedo not that good. Third application. Smell that. Beautiful, isn't it? Sicilian lime. I suppose having a goatee like this is handy if you're in a rush. If you want to shave and you're in a rush for work. <laughs> but uh, otherwise. So Fatip Piccolo against the growth. Gillette Ruby, second use. Both doing very well so far. You can hear it sing, certainly. Yeah. And uh, the, yesterday was um, five degrees, so just above freezing, frost. And it has, you know, that damp coolness where we have in this country, anyway cold and damp feeling where it feels colder than it actually is but and that's winter then you know that's uh See on there, it looks a bit. What's that for? Oh, that'll do. That'll do. Absolutely. 
absolutely stunning slickness. Well, you know what it is now. <laughs> Three, two, one. Pick up time, baby. And before we do that, I want to show you something. Uh, a viewer and his good lady, uh, wife, Pam and John, uh, live in Texas. And John sent me a few things. Well, the, the Gillette Ruby may have mentioned it. And uh, some things for the, the other channel. Um, some uh, beef jerk, Bucky's hot and spicy beef jerky. I'm going to look forward to using that. Anyway, Pam sent me a keyring because John had sent me one. Don't mess with Texas. I've used it many times. So Pam said, I've got to send you a better one. Because <laughs> she's a Louisiana girl. And this is the Louisiana State University key, uh, bottle opener. And one thing I didn't realise when I used it, this is a beer um, I've opened. So when you've opened it with a can, with a bottle opener, it's a magnet, <laughs> so it doesn't drop. It's handy, so you can just stick it there, so it doesn't put it one side while you have your beer. Anyway, isn't that nice? It's wood, obviously a magnet in there somewhere. And this is a stitched. Louisiana State University, so it's nice. Thank you so much Pam and John. I'm not sure if Pam watches these, but I'm sure John will pass the message on. I caught there, didn't I? Right, pick up time, baby, come on. What's that out with Do you know what? Oh, you've had an accident, and I'm entitled to come back. Yeah, I've gone that. No being work today. How many times have we heard that joke? From me, I mean. Love that sound. Beautiful. We'll rinse with Welsh water. And I think I'll just go over with the alum. I wasn't going to, but I will do, I think. I'm open it up. Cold water. A bit of a bite there, a bit of a kickback, a bit of a sting. I'm just doing this job. There we go. I want to use some um, witch hazel as well. Use a bit of alum just to tidy them little nicks up. One or two there, it's, as I say, it's quite an aggressive razor. And if you overdo it like I do, <laughs> there we go. 
Humphreys, citrus, <laughs> lovely stuff. And then this is 4711 uh, Aqua Colonia, which is a, a, a lemon and ginger. Beautiful stuff. Uh, Oh, come on, I've had this for a long time. Smell that beautiful. Oh, come on. Mm. <laughs> when you're in the bathroom or whatever you shave, you like this, enjoying it. Whatever's happening outside that, them doors or them walls, doesn't matter. For this, this time, does not matter. Nivea Soft, you give that a go today. Um, refreshingly soft moisturising cream we know Nivea is a good stuff anyway and I've got some um, what is it beard oil or beard lotion from the last time I did this so as it gets longer there's nothing much there now but when it gets a bit longer I go over it with some oil and it seems to work out nicely so there we go that's what we look like um, all done really happy with that So what have we used? Right, the Fatip, Fatip uh, Piccolo. As I say, three piece, non-adjustable open comb, aggressive razor, but very nice. The Gillette Ruby second use, smooth um, and very close and comfortable blade. Really nice, enjoyed it. DS Cosmetic 26 millimeter tuxedo knot, Empire resin green handle. A bit of yellow in there as well, I think a bit of a light green. It's nice, did the job well. The false or faux horn ball, had that many years. The, uh, we used alum, we've used cold Welsh water, Humphreys citrus witch hazel, the 4711 aqua colonia aftershave, or is it cologne? Cologne, yeah, so we've used that. Lovely stuff. And then, well, oh, forget the main thing here. The Sicilian Lime Vulfix Old Original Shave Brush Company Luxury Shave Cream. Really nice. Good stuff. Had that many years. Um, and then, of course, the Nivea Soft to uh, maintain this. Are they coming through? Mm, a few blotches there, but over and over on the neck. But it's got to be done. I like it close. So that is it. Thank you so much for your company, for the chat. And I hope you have some fantastic shaves yourself um, today or the rest of the week. Um, stay safe, stay healthy if you can, stay happy while, uh, <laughs> while we can. And then um, I'll see you on Sunday for the weekend shave. And that'll soon come round, thankfully, because I love doing it. Yeah, many thanks, all the best, and I'll see you Sunday. Take care.